You have seen more than once words such as introvert or melancholic used on the internet. And although these words relate to psychology, I'm sure that when you stumbled upon them, you often giggled and scrolled on. But today is your lucky day. In a few minutes, I will bring you up to date on this topic in a fun and enjoyable manner. Here we will talk about melancholic, sanguine, phlegmatic, and choleric people. In humans, four of these temperament types are distinguished, but few people know that this typology was invented a long time ago. A very, very long time. It was proposed before the birth of Christ. The wise men of ancient Egypt and Mesopotamia came up with a theory that the first and most important thing in a person is their humor, or translated into human language, their liquid. Just think about it, how many different fluids flow inside our bodies? So, around 400 BC, a healer, doctor, philosopher, and just the father of medicine Hippocrates, who was well known in the neighborhood, formed the initial design of the humoral theory. Essentially, it postulates that the behavior of a person with all their emotions and needs is determined by the excess concentration of a liquid. Well, not just any liquid, but specifically one of the four, which are blood, black bile, yellow bile, and lymph. Moreover, Hippocrates linked these four vital juices with the four elements of nature. For example, blood corresponded to air, yellow bile to fire, black bile to earth, and lymph to water. I have no idea how the ancient Greek dude managed to come up with these analogies 2,500 